What's the matter, uh, little bunny? Who, who's there? H hello? Why are you <coughs> crying? Are you all right? Sorry, I didn't mean to sneak up. I'm just concerned. Uh, oh, it's mostly because of me. I was going on a first date with a guy who asked me out, and everything was going okay until he kissed my cheek. I got so flustered that I overreacted. A lot. He doesn't want to see me anymore. This always happens. Just when I think a guy might actually like me, I freak out and ruin everything. That is very unfortunate, Miss, uh, can I have your name? Oh, um, it's Dottie. Dottie Paws. What a fun name. I'm Tumult. Why don't you tell me more about yourself, Dottie Paws? I started out as an orphan, probably because I was born half-blind. My parents adopted me because they couldn't have babies of their own. Most bunnies have lots of siblings, but not me. I was an only child. It was hard to make friends. I managed, but still, it's really lonely. I'm just a plain bunny with dull colors. I used to get teased a lot for being ugly. What's worse is because of my eye and knack for freak strength, I've always been a walking disaster. A disaster who's never gonna find love. Was there anyone in particular who caught your fancy? Oh, th that would be Professor Harrington. He's so passionate and silly and smart. And whenever we talk, he has a way of making me feel scared special and like I'm gonna float away into the clouds. He's the whole reason I go to the academy. But that's just some silly impossible schoolgirl crush. There's no way we'd now, ever- Now, now, don't, don't be don't like be that. Like what if I told you you can have him? All you need is a little work and you could woo any bunny you wanted. Why settle for whatever you can get when you can get whatever you want? I, I don't know. It all seems a little too good to be true. And I was told to be wary of a fox's kindness. That's a stereotype. You should be ashamed. Oh, oh, sorry. I didn't mean it like that. Listen, you're sweet and I want to help. Just let me give you a sample of my power for a week. I can put you in contact with beings outside this reality who can give you advice and company. All you have to do is agree to be friends, Dottie. Is that so sinister? Um, well, no, and if it's just a sample, I guess I got nothing to lose. And it's good to have a new friend. I couldn't agree more. Trust in me, just in me, shut your eyes, trust in me, you can sleep safe and sound, no Senses will cease to resist. Just relax, be at rest like a bird in a nest. Trust in me. Professor? It just sounds so impossible. 
Oh, Dottie Paws, all you need is a little more confidence. If you stick with me, your dreams can finally become reality. Trust in me. Just in me. Shut your eyes. Trust in me. So, you really think I could be with the professor? No, Dottie. I don't think so. I know so. And I will help that happen. So take my paw and trust me. Okay, well... Here goes nothing. Excellent.